everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new my name is Leah and today I'm going to be sharing some of my favorite simple and affordable tips for decorating your front porch for fall friends I wanted to give you guys a little walk through of our front porch decorated for fall as I'm filming this I see a nerf bullet there that I missed but that's okay um, this is definitely more of a laid-back kind of casual style video I'm just gonna walk you guys through and share a few of the things that I did in case you're looking for a few tips to decorate your own front porch on a budget so I did keep our same welcome mat that I've had all summer long it's not exactly fall but um, it's not really seasonal I mean you can always say hello right so I decided to just give it a good cleaning and reuse it for the fall season but I did go ahead and buy a little mat to put underneath it and that I found at Target. We were so blessed this year to have neighbors who let us clip a few things of corn from their uh, cornfields. It was just kind of left over from where they harvested and so they let us clip a few pieces from their field and it's drying out nicely. Um, so we didn't have to pay any money for this corn but you can buy it pretty cheap uh, at Lowe's or Pumpkin Patches. I see lots of places selling these little bundles um, but that instantly transformed our porch from summer to fall just by putting this corn up. And then everything else I've just clipped from our own yard. I love this grass and as it continues to dry, it gets so pretty and fluffy and I just love the way it looks. Um, it's completely dried now, um, but before it, I'll show you a before clip of what it looked like before I clipped it. Um, but most people have these in their yard. You just might not realize it. So you can clip that and put it in a little pot. And then these flowers are the pretty seed implants that I showed you guys in my garden tour and they are drying really pretty as well just a really pretty burgundy color perfect for fall and then I went to the barn and just grabbed some handfuls of straw and stuffed in around there to create these fall planters here's a closer look at some of the pumpkins that I recently purchased at that pumpkin patch I was telling you about and I really love how those look as well they're definitely unique but I love how I can stack them together and it offers a muted version of fall and I really like that as you know that's pretty much how I've decorated our entire house just kind of muted colors very soft and serene and then this yellow mum kind of makes everything pop that was a gift from my mom here's a closer look at the little bucket that I put together it just has some more dried flowers that I've clipped from the yard and then I added a few pumpkins on top that I got at the patch this is probably my favorite part of our porch for fall and that's these dried flowers that I clipped and the more they dry the prettier they get I mean they're just so pretty and you just can't beat decorating for fall this way it just definitely is bringing nature into your home or onto your porch and there's really no better way to decorate uh, so I just clipped again more flowers and sort of laid them across this planter that I had and then I added a couple of white pumpkins on top and stuffed a little bit more straw in there as well and completed this planter. For the front door, I did not do a wreath this year. I just went with this wall planter that I have. It's just a galvanized little wall pocket. I believe it came from Kirkland's a few years ago. And we still have our screen in because we've had some warm days. So it's nice to open up the screen door and let some air in. Um, so you can't really see it as well, but I will open this up and show you. Um, but this is just, like I said, a galvanized pocket. I slipped in some faux eucalyptus that I already had and then I grabbed a few of these um, dried stems that I had in another arrangement in the house just kind of borrowed from what I already had in the house and put this together but it's very simple but I think it goes nicely with the rest of the choices on this front porch. <music>
all so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you're new so you don't miss out on future videos. Hope you guys have an awesome day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Thank you.